Okay, here we go. Laundry test. This is a pile of clothes. Um, boy clothes that have been sweated in, um, piled in a laundry basket, wet towels that have been wet and showered after and stuck in the washing machine, and a little bit of a drippy washing machine that then dripped water into them where they were sitting and kind of fermenting, I guess, for a day or so. Um, and then my daughter needed to wash her clothes, so I took them all out and I put them in a basket last night so she could wash hers first, and then I forgot about them. So they've been sitting here um, wet and nasty for a very long time, and they don't smell so good. Um, so we're gonna give this the ultimate laundry test, and I can't stand like that. These are my doTERRA abode laundry pods. Um, these have been, they came out fall of 2021, and I have loved them. They seem to get out all the smells. So this is gonna be my ultimate laundry test as of late. So I'm gonna show you what they look like. If I can open it with one hand. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay. They look like this. It's just like, almost like a dishwasher packet. Little laundry pod. But they don't have any toxic chemicals and stuff in them. So all you have to do, you don't even need to use like the little soap thing, right? You just stick it in there on top of the load. Okay? Put it on top of the load. And then we're going to run it. And then what I also have is I have these fragrant what are these um laundry sheets oh just kidding they're gone i was gonna say i'm gonna try a separate one with that one but i'm done with those so just kidding scratch that reverse it i'm cropping this video okay so i put the laundry pod in on top i'm going to close it i'm going to run it on active wear so let's see i'll put it on active wear. nope on easy care which is a warm temperature and medium thing it runs for an hour and we're gonna see what happens with our laundry pods. And then I'll come back and let you know. Start. Okay, here we go. Okay, our washer has beeped. I have not even, where is it? It's over there. I have not even opened it yet. So I'm gonna open it with you so you can get my first-hand reaction of what this smells like after using my doTERRA laundry pods, which I have loved so far. So I'm excited to see how this worked with my really stinky stuff. Okay, here we go. Nice clothes. Let's see, those are boy gym shorts. Wow. Okay. Right in the crotch. Nope, nothing. It smells absolutely divine. Oh, that one's got full of stuff. I'm going to have to um, <laughs> do the dryer before I can put them in there. But it smells good. Okay, let's see. Stock. So boy sock. Shirt that had been like stuck and fermenting for three days. Absolutely no scent. Look. Like, I just want to put it in my face, which is not normally the case when I wash a bunch of clothes that have been fermenting for a couple, three days out there. Um, so that's super, super underwear, <laughs> super win, super win, super win. So good. Okay, I'm going to empty the dryer and I'm going to put these things in the dryer. And then I actually, I'm sitting on the laundry basket so I can be shorter for you this time. So I have the rest of the load here. I put it in half and half. Um, another cool tip that I learned was that if you fill your washer like clear up here, then it actually makes your clothes pill faster because they don't have as much room to move around. So I only fill it halfway now um, when I do it. And so it doesn't make the clothes pill as much. And I found one more of my laundry sheets. So this is an Earth Breeze fragrance free um, laundry sheet, which I had switched to these a few months back. I'd done all the making of my own laundry soap and all of that before. Um, and then I switched to these and then doTERRA came out with these. And so I'm going to do a test with this compared to that with my last of these laundry sheets so that you can see what happens with the same load of all the nastiness that has been soaked in there for three days. And I'm actually going to have to be gone for a little bit. So I'm going to start this one when I get back so that it's not going to have extra time sitting in the washer afterwards that will mess with my timer. I want to be able to be here to make sure that I check it right as soon as it's done. Okay, see ya. Okay, here we go. This is the doTERRA laundry pod, this one. And they are out and they are dry. Sweaty boy pants that sat in the dryer for like three, or washer for three days with water. Ah, it all smells good. Love it. Okay, now we're gonna open the washer and we're gonna check the other ones that we did with, I don't know what I did with the box. Did I throw it away? Some, nope, it's there. Okay, this, the Earth Breeze. This one is in the washing machine. We're gonna open that one and smell what it smells like before it goes in the dryer. 
Okay, this is the opening of the washing machine that we used the Earth Breeze on. Earth Breeze fragrance free um, laundry sheet. The last one I had, we used it in here. So we're gonna see what it is like at the washing machine, okay? There we go. These were the same load of stinky boy clothes that got soaked in water and sat for a long, long time. Three days, nasty, before I noticed them. Oh, that's not cool. Okay, so they, mm, mm -mm, not cool. Um, I didn't add anything else. When I used to use my homemade laundry detergents, I would use the homemade laundry detergent and if it was really bad, I would sprinkle it with baking soda and On Guard. And then I would use vinegar in the rinse for fabric softener and that would do pretty well. This one, I didn't use anything extra. It was just the Earth Breeze sheet and it is horrible just right out of there. So I'm going to take this load. We're going to leave it right there and we are going to take a doTERRA laundry pod and we're going to throw it in there. So they sat, open it one-handed again. So they sat in there um, for like three days in water because I have a little drip so it drips down and if you put clothes in there and just let it sit then they get soggy so I usually put the clothes in the basket then I just make sure it's drained before I put them in so I did they did I didn't know that because we were shoving stuff in there so it got dripped got left out left in the bucket nasty for a couple days um and then I took it put it back in and I washed half the load with a laundry pot a doTERRA laundry pot and it was fabulous smells so good and then this half we did with the Earth Breeze laundry sheet, which is what I was using before doTERRA came out with their laundry pods. And they still stink bad. Um, so I'm going to take a doTERRA laundry pod, throw it on top, and we're going to run it again on Easy Care, ooh, Easy Care Warm. There we go. Easy Care Warm, normal, medium. Ding, ding, ding. Push start. Okay. One hour and I'll be back. Okay. Back in the laundry. Here we go. We tried this and the clothes came out stinky still you've already heard the video so i'm missing this taylor so i'm not going to repeat it then i put in a doTERRA pod so i ran it again after it was still stinky so here's what we're going to do we're gonna check it out grand reveal right laundry okay oh my gosh it's so heavenly oh okay let's see it's like fresh and clean and amazing. And there's no, there's no funky musty smell. There's no, it's got stuck in my washer for three days nasty smell. There's no, I ran it and it's still stunk smell. It's like fresh and awesome. So if you're thinking like laundry stuff, this is my newfound favorite. It works on everything. It works Oh, so amazingly fabulous. And I highly recommend it to absolutely everyone. It's like, I think it was $20 wholesale. Um, and then you can get it below wholesale if you talk to me. Um, I can help you get it below wholesale. 45 laundry pods. This will do my family of seven for at least a month. Because I usually only do like one load a day. Or not even that. Or I'll do like no loads for three days and then I'll do three at once. So this will last me over a month. For 20 bucks for my whole family of seven and to not have to double triple wash stuff and worry about things coming out halfway stinky and all the different issues that happen with laundry it's literally been my entire life searching for the perfect laundry something and doTERRA came out with it so thank you doTERRA okay so i dried these last night and then um left them in the dryer because i forgot <laughs> so here's the clothes the last load it came out um, the ones that we were stinky and we washed them with the dryer sheets and then we washed them with the doTERRA stuff and then we got them out of the dryer and they smell good. We're good. Okay, here we are. I want to walk you through what this looks like on doTERRA's end. So when you go to doTERRA, you can search laundry up here. I'll put a link that goes directly to this product down below where you guys can get that. So here it says doTERRA laundry pods. They are $26 retail. Don't buy retail always buy wholesale. So make sure that you sign up for a wholesale account or contact me and we'll get you hooked up with the best deal possible because you can actually get up to 30% back in free product. So it's $19.50 for 45 of them. And that 45 breaks out to about 43 cents a load, which is amazing in order to have the great smelling only have to wash it once saves you so much time, so much water, so much everything. Um, and then you'll get so as you build up your points, you can actually get up to 30% back. So let's see, $14.43 or five, 
$6 plus $4 shipping, you'll get almost $10 back in free doTERRA product if you have a wholesale account and they teach you how to set it up so you get the most back on your deal while protecting and caring for your family in a safe, natural, effective way while doing this. It is amazing. I love it. Okay, and then I'm going to give a little disclaimer here. So I did the test with these Earth Breeze because that was the last one that I had. When I first switched to the laundry detergent sheets, I actually got this True Earth brand first. These are the first ones I heard about. And I liked them, and they actually work better, I think, than the Earth Breeze does. So if you really want to do the pads rather than the doTERRA, then there's an option as well. But I would definitely choose the doTERRA pods over all of it with all the free stuff that you're going to get back, the products that makes it so easy that my kids can just take it and throw it in as well. It makes everything easy awesome and then if you're while you're here if you go up here up to shop and you can go to the abode line and this has all of doTERRA's new cleaning products they have dishwasher pods that work like the laundry pods and they are so good and then they have these gorgeous bottles that you can put up on your kitchen counter they've got the lotions and the um, surface sprays and all the stuff that is totally non-toxic and so good for your family and I love every bit of it so check it out contact me down below um, get yourself some awesome laundry soap and um, products and essential oils if you don't know about essential oils I'm just going to pop over here so you can see them for a second there is a whole bunch of different oils and they all work with different kinds of your body and the different systems. So there's digestive system support, there's immune system support, there is skin support, so many different things. This is super cool. They've got these wellness programs and you can actually choose. So this is respiratory, sleep, relief, immunity, mind and mood and digestion. And then they'll just send you this cute little bag with all the things that you need in it. And it's amazing. Okay, I'm done with my doTERRA rant for now, but get your laundry pods, check it out. It's amazing. You're gonna love it just as much as I do and have a super great night. Just kidding, one more thing I gotta tell you. So another reason that I love doTERRA is that one, it's great for the environment, it's not gonna hurt anything. But in the meantime, it's great for the environment, it's great for your family. And every purchase that you make goes to making a difference in the world. Every essential oil that they make, all of the things that they source come from all around the world, from people who are, struggling who need an economic support and they build hospitals and they build schools and they raise communities and they raise people and they raise leaders and they teach them business skills along the way so this is co-impact sourcing this is part of doTERRA's initiative you can watch all these really amazing videos too about how doTERRA makes a difference in the world and like i cannot pick another company i'd rather stand behind as much as i do doTERRA and then there is one more I'm going to show you. doTERRA Healing Hands. This is their the side that goes together, and they will actually work to fight human trafficking, and they do rescue rescue initiatives. And if once you have joined doTERRA, you can actually do this program, and they will help fund the causes that are important to you, and they'll match your fundraising. It's amazing. So many things. I'll put those links down for you and thing at the bottom as well.